Hey guys, welcome back to Swiss Watch Expo. Vlad is here. And a lot of time at Swiss Watch Expo, we're talking about watches that are came in from like past years. We're talking about vintage technologies and stuff like that. But today I'm going to present two timepieces that come with like the modern technologies and the current look at the uh, watch industry. So we're going to discuss IWC uh, engineer and then the DeFi models. Hey guys, welcome back. And as I said, the watchmaking is super old industry and a lot of times we're discussing something more vintage or vintage inspired uh, when we're talking about watches. But today we're going to talk about much more modern pieces with more technologies, modern casing and things like that. So what we have up here is IWC Engineer and the um, Zenit Defy models. Both models are current production sport models in both collections of IWC and Zenit. And let's probably start first with this uh, beautiful IWC engineer. Uh, we are probably all familiar with the history of this watch. It was introduced and was designed by Gelo Denta. It was introduced in 1970s and 80s to kind of be a competitor to the Nautilus and Royal Oaks. But uh, what they're doing right now with this watch is uh, very different because they, they actually modernize it much uh, more than, uh, for example, a Royal Oak or a Nautilus did with Patek and AP accordingly. Uh, what we're looking for, it's up here, it's IWC Engineer Performance. And this watch is limited to 1,000 pieces made and actually made in collaboration with the uh, Mercedes AMG uh, Petronas Formula One team uh, from Mercedes. And that's where you get the design um, language of this watch. So we have the uh, this beautiful black design, which a lot of Mercedes, like they use in their cars, their black colors or like gray colors. Um, and the green uh, green accents on the watch. You will see the green accents on the dial and on the strap that is matching the, the watch. So everything is connected with MG and they put the best technologies into this timepiece. Uh, the case we're looking at is 46 millimeters. It's definitely a bigger uh, timepiece and it's, uh, its thickness is 14.5 millimeters. So even though the watch is pretty thick, uh, if you kind of like look at the everything together, like the the size of the case and the thickness, it's very proportional to this watch. Um, case made from carbon fiber. So this material, it's always used in the car industry because it's very, very light, but super, super sturdy. So um, in the watch is also one of the good things that they use the carbon fiber cases because again, like it can go through a little bit more shock or like it, it will be more shock resistant. Uh, in the performance of watch. So you cannot, you can be a little bit more harsh with the timepiece than you will be with um, other timepieces that are made from other materials. Uh, the movement of this watch is powered by in-house IWC Caliber 80110 and it's have a 40 hour power reserve. It's also very beautifully decorated. So if you will look at the case back, uh, with everything is IWC, all their movements are super big and uh, it's very nicely decorated. So beautiful watch. Uh, a lot of fans of Formula One uh, can purchase it. A lot of fans who love the modern watches and this look of the uh, interesting materials combining with a nice design, everything with the history of the watch will be a great addition to your collection. So if you are interested in IWC Engineer and want to add a little bit more special piece to your collection, this is definitely a good choice to go with. And I don't even talk about the price because you can get it for less than 50% of the original retail. Um, moving forward is the Zenit Defi. It's one of the most popular collection right now in the Zenit, uh, and they decided to put all the current technologies into this collection. A lot of times they are coming with the skeleton dials, and as you can see in this example. Uh, so similar with the IWC Engineer, it's a carbon fiber case. Uh, the only difference is it's coming 44 millimeter case. Uh, it's a little bit uh, smaller size, but the same thickness as 14.5 millimeters. But I think in both of them, because they kind of come with the uh, integrated rubber strap, it's very nice look and it does not look too bulky or too big on the wrists uh, of people who will wear it. Um, the watch is worth this up to 100 meters and it's running on the in-house caliber from uh, Zenit. Uh, it's 9004 and have 50 hour power reserve. And obviously with, this, this, uh, with Zenit Defy, it's very interesting to look at the dial because there's so many elements. They decided to open everything that's going on inside of this watch so you can see it. And beautifully decorated rotor on the case back also added to aesthetic of the watch. So you have the Zenit Star that will be spinning and giving the watch the power reserve uh, that it have. And it's also matching with the um, 
carbon fiber buckle on the rubber strap. So everything in this watch is made from carbon fiber. So overall, the weight of the watch is much lighter and it will have a very nice performance on your wrist. So if you are interested in adding something more recent, something more modern to your collection, and you're looking for something sportier, those two models will be a great addition. And please give us a call at Swiss Watch Expo. We'll be happy to help you with them.